Thank you for coming along for the ride today. Mike O'Brien, your getaway guy, the Erie Canal. We've all seen it, but have you been on it? No better way to be on it than on board this beauty out of the village of Fairport, the Colonial Bell. Come on. Yes, this is the way to see the legendary and historic Erie Canal. We are so fortunate to have the Colonial Bell right there out of Packets Landing in Fairport. What a great way to do this. And by the way, bridge coming up, heads down. You can't stand or get up at all when you go under most of the bridges. Otherwise, you're going to hit your head, but there's plenty of warning. What a great way to see the Erie Canal. This is a great family getaway. I enjoyed this so much. I was on this years ago with the late, great Captain Lee. Now his daughter, Captain Tammy, has taken over in a great way. She is an expert at this. She learned from the best. There's a deck upstairs and there's a deck downstairs. And it's a great way to see the Erie Canal. You bring your hat because it gets sunny and a little toasty up there. Some people opt for an umbrella, but whatever you do, a covering is a good way to go when you're upstairs. But again, there's two floors, upstairs or downstairs. And by the way, it is handicap accessible on the lower deck, which is nice to know. There's Captain Tammy taking over. She does a great job narrating the history and talking about everything on your tour on the Colonial Bell. Again, out of Packets Landing in Fairport. And it's a wonderful way to see everything. Get your tickets at colonialbell.com or give them a call, 223-9470. That's 585-223-9470. But the website is a great way to see the schedule, and grab your tickets, Colonial Bell, and that's B-E-L-L-E dot -E com. I enjoyed myself, and you will too. They do everything on this thing. They, they do lunch and dinner cruises. They do regular scenic cruises. They do private charters all along the Erie Canal. They even do murder mystery cruises, which is disturbing to me. <laughs> I love this getaway because you see our area much like those from long ago when uh, this was a major highway before highways. So w what a great way to grab some history. Colonial Bell, out of Fairport. Get your tickets now. Colonialbell.com. I'm just going to let you watch some pictures here and I'll kind of be quiet. It's a great way to get around. And you see so much. Yeah, head down. You'll notice Captain Tammy has to kind of duck a little bit. That comes closer than you think. And by the way, that was the bridge in Fairport, and that actually raises for them. And then one of the cr uh, cruises goes into the lock, Lock 32, and that's what this is. And I was able to capture some of the action as the Colonial Bell went into the lock. So... They do a basic uh, family special on Sundays that you need to know about for only 19 bucks. Otherwise, basic adult tickets begin at $30. But go online, colonialbell.com, and you'll see all your options. But it's the Great American Canal, the Erie Canal, uh, and, and it's been around forever. And this is a great way to see it and enjoy. People love it. They really do, and they come from everywhere. Um, I really like the historical facts. I've always been a history girl. I think it's very scenic. I think... The nature around it's really beautiful. Would you recommend this to friends? Absolutely. Oh, yeah. What would you say to them? <laughs> I would say, let's go on a boat. <laughs> yeah, let's go on the Erie Canal. <laughs> Coming up next, another great way to see the Erie Canal on a much smaller boat. You're a little bit closer to the water. I'll show you that in a second. Don't go away. That's less than 60 seconds away. I've got an Erie Ca Canal Museum, actually a couple of them, that a lot of people are interested in. We got a, a question uh, sent to us, and I thought this would be the appropriate time to address that travel question. So I'll show you that in a second. And I also have um, a great cabin getaway. If you want to get away from the world in these days, it's crazy. This is a nice, quiet escape. 
and I'm going to show you that getaway coming up next as well. But first, I want to thank our friends from Paris Heating and Cooling. Has it been hot enough? Oh my goodness, what a summer. Well, Paris will take care of you if you want to maybe tune up your current AC system, or maybe it's time for an upgrade. Paris Heating and Cooling will take good care of you. It's who I use. They are a family operation. Check them out at parisheatcool.com or give them a call 585-227-4512. Tis the season to get that AC checked out, and they'll take good care of you. Paris Heating and Cooling, I was amazed at how fast they can turn around that schedule and get you taken care of. ParisHeatCool.com. And if you're looking for baked goods or fruits and vegetables or flowers, there's no place that I would rather go to than Powers Farm Market, 161 Marsh Road, Pittsford family operation. Uh, they've been doing this forever in Pittsford. Uh, they've got everything from flowers to fruits, vegetables. The baked goods are to die for. Check out Power. Oh, and my travel book is there too. Just throwing that in. But you're going to love Powers right on Marsh Road in Pittsford, one of our favorite places to visit. Hey, welcome back to the show. Time for another boat ride on the Erie Canal. This time, a smaller boat. This time on board, the Sam Patch. Yeah, you can get on board the Sam Patch. Tours on board the Sam Patch bring you a different perspective, a little bit closer to the water, a smaller kind of environment, but it's kind of nice. Live narration and a trip through a century old lock. They too go into lock 32. The boat is a replica 1800s packet boat, and she's beautiful. She leaves out of uh, Port of Pittsford uh, from Shone Place, or some say Shane Place. Uh, every day, this time of year, they uh, as well offer all types of cruises, starting at 25 bucks uh, per cruise. You can go to their website and get your tickets there at cornhillnav.org. CornhillNav.org or call them 585-662-5748. But it's a great way to see the canal, a little bit smaller version, and it's a great way to get into the lock system. Although with the sand patch, you're really down below until that water raises you up. But what better way to see the Erie Canal than on these two options which make for great getaways for families and friends. People coming in from out of town love something unique. And boy, you could really show them a good time when doing something like this. The Sam Patch, the Colonial Bell, both available and close by and affordable as well. And I like them both a lot. That's just a pretty sight, isn't it? Another pretty sight is when you get home and you open up your pizza box and you see an amazing creation by Nino's. We want to thank them for being part of our show. Uh, okay, I'm going to I'm gonna confess I was there the other day. And I got to tell you, it's kind of funny. I walked in and there's a close, well, not a close friend, but a friend who was also getting the pizza. And we both kind of uh, said, hi, hi. <laughs> Guilty pleasure at Nino's Pizzeria, 1330 Culver Road. They have been doing pizza for a long time and it just doesn't get any better or fresher. They're a little hole in the wall uh, at 1330 Culver Road, right near Merchants. Nino's, tell them the getaway guy sent you. You know, we do questions. People ask us questions all the time. This one I thought was appropriate for today's getaway. Uh, and it's a question uh, that comes from a viewer. By the way, today's question is brought to you by, you ready for some ice cream? Brought to you by Lugia's for the best and biggest ice cream cone around. And I mean big. And they also have Frank's Italian Ice. Lugia's Lyle and Manito Road in Spencerport. Today's question, Roxanne from Rochester writes, Dear Getaway Guy, I've heard there are some small Erie Canal museums in the region. Can you suggest any? I'm a huge history fan. Yes, Roxanne, there are a few. Great question, by the way. And these are little places that a lot of people don't know about. For instance, just east of Wheatsport on Route 31, the village of Jordan, uh, and the Jordan Historical Society and Museum. You're going to see artifacts from the Erie Canal and a ton of local history too, which is amazing. It's like kind of walking back in time. Erie Canal history at 15 Mechanic Street in Jordan, New York. Take exit 40, Weedsport, south on 34 and then east on 31, about an hour out of Rochester. Also, there's the Camillus Erie Canal 
Isle Museum and Boat Tours just west of Syracuse, open now through early October. They do boat rides too on the Erie Canal. And there's the Erie Canal Museum in downtown Syracuse with the only remaining Waylock building in the country. Have a question? I'd love to hear it. Or a suggestion when it comes to travel, just go to the website or actually go to my email address, MikeTheGetawayGuy at gmail.com. Ask away and we'll see if we can't help you out. MikeTheGetawayGuy at gmail.com. Also, I want to tell you about a getaway. If you're looking for a little hidden gem, like out of the area and kind of, but close enough so that you're not forever away, maybe two hours away near Watkins Glen, Catherine Cottages. They are an amazing set of cottages right on Catherine Creek. Montour Falls is the location, uh, and, and it's a great little hidden gem. If you want a nice, peaceful, relaxing getaway, reserve your cottage. Mention the getaway guy. You'll get a discount on weekday rentals, okay? CatherineCottages.com is the website. When you mention the getaway guy, give him a call, 607-535-0000. That's an easy number to remember, 607-535-0000. Mention the getaway guy, get a nice weekday rental, and get a discount when you mention the getaway guy. Catherine Cottages, love them. Travel books. I Well, I suggest you love these because there's 50 getaways in the travel book. And they're some of my favorites that you may have seen me do on TV. Uh, the Getaway Guy, 50 more getaways, only $10 and I'll throw in the free shipping. All you have to do is email me, tell me what you need. We'll sign it to whoever you'd like, MikeTheGetawayGuy at gmail.com. I'll give you all the particulars. MikeTheGetawayGuy at gmail.com, 10 bucks, free shipping too. And I think, I think you'll use it probably quite a bit. If you could use a good cup of coffee, I suggest you go to Jim's. Oh, yeah. You probably run into me at the counter. That's my seat. Jim's on Main, 785 East Main Street, down from the auditorium. Boy, if you want a good breakfast for not a whole lot of money, I suggest you go to Jim's. They also have a location at the Grease Ridge Mall, uh, or the mall at Grease Ridge, breakfast, lunch, dinner there. But Jim's on Main, that's where... I love to go 785 East Main Street for breakfast or lunch mm -mm -mm, and good coffee. Cash only, Jim's on Main. Thank you for being a part of our show. We also want to thank Powers for being a part of our show. All I think about is their baked goods. Every time I go by there, I go, I could pull in and get a pie, <laughs> but I probably won't do that. Uh, Powers Farm Market, summertime is outstanding. They also have the live animals for the kids. So it's a great place to go to shop a little bit, maybe grab uh, one of my travel books. You can do that too. They have them all signed. 161 Marsh Road. It's a great place to go for flowers, baked goods, fruits, vegetables. I think corn is in now too, isn't it? Uh, and you're going to love Powers. It's one of those family operations, a generational gem on Marsh Road in Pittsburgh. And Paris Heating and Cooling. Boy, you couldn't have come at a better time it is hot out there. It's probably going to be hotter than ever through August. I suggest you get your AC tuned up or maybe upgrade to a good AC system. Paris Heating and Cooling, these are the people that will take care of you right away. It's family owned. They've been doing this for 35 years. Go to Paris. Check them out. ParisHeatCool.com or 227-4512. We want to thank them. We want to thank uh, Powers, Lugia's. We'd like to thank Nino's, Jim's on Main, and Catherine Cottages, and certainly Joe here at Classy Wolf Media. And thank you for coming along for the ride. Until next time, I'm Mike O'Brien, your getaway guy. <laughs>